everybody. This is Coach. Hi, everybody. This is Coach Tyra Woodruff, the Mind Reset Coach, coming to you out of Holiday, Florida, here in my home office. It's a beautiful day. The breeze is coming in on me and feeling so good. I wanted to show you something about the double opt-in and get response. Now, you want to have a double opt-in. It's very important to have a double opt-in. This way, you reduce the risk of people not even knowing who you are and possibly reporting your email as spam and whatnot. I'm going to show you a couple of things that I learned yesterday because I want to make sure that I had my double opt-ins correctly done and I want you to know because there's a couple of steps that you want to take to ensure that people when they sign up for your list for whatever it is that you're promoting at the particular time, whatever capture page you're using, you're not just going to, um, you're going to continue to email these people. So you want them to know that they're on your list and make sure that they double opt-in, okay? So let me go on see my screen here. We may have interruptions. We've got uh, people next door painting. So, and my dog right now is being very nice and not barking about it, which I'm impressed. And uh, we just had an unexpected guest. So let me go ahead and see. You can see my screen. Excellent. So what you're going to do here is right up here, on your your regular dashboard this is where you create new campaigns okay so i have several campaigns going on here i have my mind valley campaign my local marketing mastery campaign um this is a campaign that's not active yet because i haven't created an affiliate for my membership site yet coach Terrace youtube boot camp uh a regular straight up subscription campaign and there's marketing with me campaign okay that's right here so let's go ahead and go to this little toolbar on the side and what it's going to do is going to bring you straight to this section of your campaign now this is where you can name it so i'm going to separate the words here save oh i can't separate the words there <laughs> Maybe that's why I had it that way, right? Save. Let's just cancel that. This is general information about it, all right? This is your postal address has to be in your emails anyway. This is where, excuse me, <coughs> I do all my um, business through my campaigns. So here is another thing. This is your profile. You want to set this up. It's different for every single campaign. Let me take a sip of my, my drink. You have to set this up manually per campaign. You go ahead and give it a title. Give it a category. Now, here there are several categories. Agencies, automotive, education, financial service, health and beauty, health care, <coughs> so on and so on. Pick one that you think suits what you got going on, okay? Um, you can also do a campaign description. I left that alone. I created a logo on PicMonkey. Okay, this is a 400 by 150. Thank you for subscribing to my email updates, and it's clear my name is there, okay? So this particular Marketing With Me campaign is for people that sign up to look at Alex Jeffries' products, okay? I am a super affiliate with Alex Jeffries. And this way, they know that even though they are looking at his products, they're on my list. Okay, it's really important. And it also goes back to my membership site, to my website, okay? And you can look at what the confirmation page looks like. When they sign up for my email, this is what they get in their email box. They get that. They have a picture of me, a clear picture of me. Thank you, subscribing. My name, thank you, subscribing. The name of the list they're on. Okay. Now, if they were to click through there, they would go straight to my membership site. All right. Let me go back. Now, here is the permissions page. I want you to see this. Okay. You're going to leave the email subscriptions and web subscriptions, and you're going to leave the HTML button the way it is. It's already like that. You're going to do your from field. You want to make sure that it's from Tara Woodruff at Tara, Tara Woodruff at your web-based domain that you have with GoDaddy or um, uh, 
GDI or get what do you call it? Um, Bluehost. Oh, there's a bunch of places. And usually you have a choice. Always do your web-based domain. Don't use the one that's free that you, you probably do use. Your message subject. There's plenty, plenty of already set up messages. Now you can do a custom subject, but if you're sending out like right now, I have this particular campaign is going out for solo ad. So if I was to change this and do it custom right now, it might delay people too long where they they don't even remember logging in to look. So I just kept it basic. I want their first name because I always ask for it, confirmation request for it, and the responder name, which is my name. Okay, so they will be confirming, yes, they are signed up for Tower Woodruff's list, okay? And that's basically it, guys. You want to make sure you do it with all of them. This is how you go find it. You do that drop-down box. You hit the, the new campaign that you want to make sure you have set up correctly. Okay. You want to go to the profile. Make sure you have everything in there that you need. Your permission. Make sure it's the, the one that you want. Like I said, there's a lot. They all work. Okay. It's just up to you what you like. And then it automatically changes the settings. And this one is, if you have it, it's a good thing I came over here. If you have it going to your Yahoo, it will bounce your, your subscription. So you want to make sure you got that straight. So it automatically saves. Let's go ahead while we're here and double check everybody. Should change this logo. Definitely internet marketing, even though it's an educational service. Where I have this particular it's located at my membership site. So if somebody wants to join my membership site, they get access to all of my courses that I have so far and whatever comes. So this is what they would get. Excellent. So it's very clear it's from me. It's a very clear, you know, it's easier when it's your own product, but when you're being an affiliate for someone, which affiliate marketing guys, I like to tell you this, is a really beautiful thing. 90% of the time, <coughs> excuse me, I have a really bad cough. 90% of the time, it's free. So if there's ever a product out there that you really, really want, and you just don't have the bank to get it, See if there's an affiliate program with it and promote it talking about, you know, obviously if there's a product that you want, you either love the person selling it or you love the material, <coughs> you will be able to create a campaign to try to sell this product. Now, once you get the money up to buy the product, you buy the product. Otherwise, I really suggest that, you know, if you can, you buy the product first and then become an affiliate. As a matter of fact, when social media local prospecting formula from Jessica Hignan. Let's make sure I'm sure I don't have this done. Um, this course I do not own. <coughs> but I absolutely love her um, trainings and one thing that 
I found she always does a really good uh, webinar before her launches, and uh, that makes a big difference because then you can create your own testimony so that you can sell something or you can Social media, local prospecting formula. There we go. And then here, I would go ahead and put my link to it. So well, let me go get the link. Oh no, I wouldn't do that. You still want the link that you're capturing email from. Because if you see that they've re opted in, then you know they're being serious business serious business so you go to your landing page creator did you find it grab the link and go ahead there we go bam permissions beautiful all set so that's how you do it, guys. I hope this helps you out a lot. So especially if you're using, if you are promoting an affiliate where it's a very branded towards the actual product or the affiliate, you want to make sure that these people know they're on your list. They're not, you know, that you are going to be sending them emails as well. Okay, so it's super important that they understand that because if they don't recognize you and they don't understand why they're there, why they're getting your emails they might report you with spam and that's not good because the more that your email is reported as spam the less likely your deliverability will be also it also somehow it reduces bounce I'm not sure if I understand bounce very much but you can be bounced I actually had my first bounce this week and what get response does because they're so awesome to keep your list as clean as possible so there's not a lot of bounces on your on your account is as soon as it's bounced, that email is removed. So the likelihood of you getting bounced and the likelihood of you getting reported as spam, if you are clear that it's you, is going to make your life so much better. You know, you could be promoting a uh, an MLM, say, and say you're capturing emails first, and people just, you know, sometimes they just don't think. They don't even know. So what happens is they think that they signed up to learn about your shake and they're getting these emails from you. So you, you need to be sure that you're clear. You know, let people know what it is. Be clear in your sales copy on your landing pages. Please be, be clear. You know, even at the bottom, you could say, you know, you will be added to Tara Woodruff's list or you, you know, something. Let them know. And then if you have this, you don't have to get really deep. They're going to get this as soon as they put their email address in. They're getting this email right here saying, hey, you're on my list. Thank you for subscribing. They're going to say, well, what the hell? Why am I on Tyra Woodruff's list? Oh, for the Mind Valley thing I just looked up. Excellent. Okay. Bam. Okay. So I hope this helps. I'm going to let you all go now and show you my face one more time. If you are watching this on YouTube, you can go ahead and join the audience and you can see what Get Response has to offer. Go ahead and click right on there. And if not, right underneath the video, the first link, of course, is the Get Response 30 day free trial. You get one landing page and 200 subscribers. You uh, you have to put the subscribers in there, but you, you can run a test. For 30 days, see what you think, see how you feel about the Get Response system. I absolutely love it. Drag and drop editing, beautiful templates. They even have these gorgeous email templates. I'm sending out some pretty fancy emails and I can track it all. I love that a lot. So, very happy. Get Response has been making my life easier, I'm streamlining what I'm doing here on the internet, and um, I'm just really excited about how things are going. So, I wanted to show you that. Make sure your people know they're on your list so this way you don't get marked out okay i love you all very much you have a beautiful day this is coach tyron woodard bye